here we go. <laughs> There was a there was a man beaten across the street last week. Okay. And then um, the bouncer from here came over and broke his phone. Okay. And then one of your employees came over and refused to talk to the witness whose phone was broken. Okay. So I'm asked why you would, uh, no, you know what, we don't answer questions, did we pick him up? No, 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 I'm just, I'm just okay. curious, no, I'm just curious, so, oh, so I'm just inquiring. Of the community. Okay, no, that's, oh, that's totally understandable, they have a right to do that. Uh, I, I just still leave me, I'll ask you, uh, as long as you're not impinging or infringing on their business. We absolutely are not. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> that's all, that's all I want to You have every right to tell it to a protest, and I'm not sure what happened, so I don't, I don't know about it. Excuse me, you're not a lot. Copy, go ahead. Hey, um, you know what, I do have a question for you. Give me one second, so I'm, I'm listening to something. Oh. Uh, copy that, thank you. Yeah, no, oh, uh, oh, listen, man, I went to a really, really lovely event uh, the other week. They saw coffee with the cops. Oh, yeah. Can you tell me if you guys are going to be doing another one of those? Uh, I, I don't know. Uh, that's usually done by our staff. They'll come up with the idea, but if we're successful, I'm going to say... I, I, was, I thought it was pretty successful. Uh, did you go to the U.S.? Absolutely, I was. Oh, good. Did you talk to a cop? Absolutely. Are oh, you so. talking to one now, too, right? Yeah, yeah we but, like to talk to No, 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 please. I... I I, uh, I, I, I don't know that I, I'm brand new here. It's my it's my third day uh, working downtown district. I came from Golden Area Command, so the other side of town, uh, on the other side of the freeway, actually. And uh, so I'm I'm so, familiar with the. So normally, if you responded to a call and somebody told you that they had evidence, including a video of what actually happened, Constantly. what would you do? I probably want to see that evidence. But, but the other side of that person, I, I, I wasn't there. I wasn't there. I wasn't there. Were you there, sir? Yeah. I wasn't physically there. Okay. Uh, so, so there's, you know, two sides to the story, so I'm not mm -hmm. sure what happened with the person that you're protesting for. Uh -huh. I'm not sure what happened with the officer. Uh, I don't know. But so we could even talk in hypotheticals. No, no but it's okay. Somebody offered you evidence. Of, a, of a, something you were investigating, it would be the proper thing to take that evidence. Sure, more than likely, more than likely. Hypothetical says absolutely. But again, there's a lot of variables that we don't know about. And I wasn't here, so I, I can't speculate. Uh, that might have been the case, and it might not have been the case. It might not have had any evidence you value. I don't know. So, well, I've, I've actually seen it, and I can guarantee you it has evidence you Well, I can. In fact, we could show it to you right now. To go ahead and show it. Let me see. Hey, uh, you want to see a video? Oh. If you have it, I'd love to see. We file a complaint with the, on uh, with the, the, the improper investigation. Okay. Sure. If, Did you go if to in fact, who did um, you file that complaint with? Well, I'm asking, can we do that? Yeah, you have a right to do that. Just go okay. to headquarters. You can absolutely do it. Okay. Sure. Sure. We'll investigate your complaint. If there's merit to it, absolutely. Mm -hmm. So, I, but again, it's like everything else. You got to look at all the facts and. Let me draw some conclusions, but I don't know what happened that night. So yeah, well, we can, can show. We can. Yeah, we can pretty clearly show you. Okay, so this is, well, this is the, the security guards beating on the homeless. Okay. We have video. And, and another person in the audio obstructing somebody. But if you look it up online, you'll hear the audio. Okay. And the guy comes, get off and get off. And the other security like, get off. Okay. But that's that's part of the reason we're here because okay. this guy. Uh, I'm mentioning that yeah, the guy filming, because you see somebody filming, he's talking about filming. Uh, doesn't br doesn't no, begin on the sidewalk right. next to the street. You know it does. No, you have a right to film anything you want. I mean, we're, we're in a new society, everything gets filmed. Well, well this, um, is, this is where the film is coming up now. Okay. Now, from um, from the other side of the street, now this is on the side, from the other side of the street, you're going to see a gentleman come over. And he's to get himself in, and it looks like he knows. Okay. And he's telling me, get out of here, look, look, and boom, hits the camera. Okay. And, I mean, this was in your jurisdiction. You can, pretty, you July, you I mean, can pretty the, uh, clearly see a guy laying on the ground being choked. Well, uh, I see somebody and, uh, laying on the ground uh, with uh, uh, somebody on top of Two people. Uh -huh. But I don't, I can't see that. It's probably not necessary. Not it may, that, that may be the case, it may not be the case. I, I don't know. I, so, I mean, if this is if this is an intoxicated person that was 
Yeah, he was laying motionless on the ground. Well, he doesn't look motionless. He, he looks pretty really motionless. Well, I'll, 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 wait, 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 wait. Yeah. 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 Well, here, you, know, you know what? You can't, you can't be And he's got three guys on top of him on top of that. The guy pushes him down. Let's stop him. And then boom. That's the beginning. Okay. Pushing him down. Punching him. Punching him. Okay. Don't get him. Don't get him. Don't get him. Look, you should pop him in the head. Yeah, but he doesn't work for me. So I'm not trying to protect him. Oh, no, no. But I'm saying, oh, my God. Yeah. And look. But okay, apparently no, one of no, one of your fellow employees there, right? was trying to protect him because he refused to take okay. the evidence. Yeah, well, 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 I'll tell you this. I, what you see there, it appears to me that the security officer struck him, but I don't know what happened. Just before it doesn't the, matter because while he's laying on the ground getting beaten, well, no, before, doesn't, before that doesn't... On, no, before, no, you go on, before you go on. Beating somebody who's defenseless is not justified by that person I'm, doing I'm something beforehand. You, what I'm saying is people are human beings, and that officer was struck and he responded, then what he's an unprofessional saying, person who shouldn't be working in security. Well, you, well, you know, listen, I, I work security. My, and you're a police officer. You let your emotions rule the way you behave out here? Well, no, we should, no we way. Well, we do sometimes. And you're, but you're supposed to be paid. When you guys make you're supposed to be a paid professional who doesn't do that. You guys got to, yeah. So that's not what we're saying. But if people don't know about it and don't see it, and they're not made aware of it, that's, that's what you're trying to make people no, aware of. No, 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 no. It doesn't matter if, they, if they're justified in um, detaining him. If they're justified in detaining him, that doesn't justify them beating him after the fact. I agree with you. But what I'm saying is I don't know what happened just before that because it just shows. Right, but I'm saying that's relevant. It is relevant, but again, it's, it's I actually not. Me, so, uh, because it's not, it's not a bouncer's job to punish somebody. Well, number one, he doesn't work for the Metro Police Department. Right. Number one. But you guys investigate crimes and assaulting somebody is a crime. Uh, sure, absolutely. Mm -hmm. But it's actually battery is the correct terminology. Yeah. Right. But regardless of that, there's a crime being committed when somebody is beating a defenseless person. Right, and I don't know what he told So he doesn't actually have to work for you for you to do the proper thing. Oh, no, no, absolutely, sir. No, absolutely. And, and I agree with you. I mean, if, if there's a, uh, an altercation between security and a, a patron, uh, absolutely, they need to act properly. We've arrested security officers. Mm -hmm. Uh, with that, if you show that and they determine that it needs to be investigated, they may do so. This happened when you say something? It was, uh, I believe, Thursday. It was the 12th. Uh, the the 12th. Do we have that? Is that victim available? That, that I believe he's in jail because you guys arrested him for getting beat up. Okay, that because the, because the, your fellow employee who showed up refused to do an actual investigation. Do you know him, sir? I don't know. But I do know that he was arrested. Okay, no, 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 I don't actually have to know somebody personally to know that they shouldn't be beaten. Absolutely. No, no, I agree with you. I'll tell you, I've been a, I've been a, on this team's agency for 23 years. And in 23 years, I've never had to uh, administer punishment upon anybody that rendered them unconscious or sent them to the hospital. So I'm usually very good at the way I handle people. And uh, I'm known, uh, I'm pretty well known in the patrol element of the Police Department. And I know what I'm yeah. doing. I know what I'm doing. There's some other guys that work with you that are known for well, some other a, stuff, though. Well, that's that the, that's, that's the problem. Yeah, and that may be true, sir. That's but I have, really I have to say, you know, we're all human beings, and even police officers, on occasion. Right. Maybe. But so, when one of those humans does something bad, he should probably be held accountable for that. Absolutely. So that it doesn't reflect badly on you. I, absolutely. 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 So that you don't have to deal with like people like us. Uh, but I, I don't mind dealing with people like you. Uh, well, you're, you're, you're a citizen, you're voicing mm -hmm. your concerns, you have every right to be. Right, right. So, I, but mind you, I have... But the problem I, is... I, I, I can put it this opportunity. Right. I can put it this opportunity. But the problem is when you guys let people off and they blatantly murder people and don't well, have any sort of... A, I'm referring to a, about 140 cases. Of, of, of I'm just, what? Of, Stanley Gibson, who was killed while he okay. sat in his car. Okay. Eric Scott, who was killed walking out of a um, Costco. Okay, well, uh, the Costco is a little bit different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, 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 we can debate that. We can debate that. We can debate that. But, we can debate that. Okay. but yeah, I mean, we could, the that. problem oh, is there's well, never, you're there's never, aren't you? You're a lot of It depends what you're doing with. See, and that's the problem is there never is a debate of it. It's automatically rubber stamped approved. Well, I, I, I'll tell you this. I, I mean, I, I know a little bit more about that particular case you're talking about. I wasn't involved with that, but I know more about what happened. And I, and I, I was, I've seen what has happened. If somebody has a gun out, it's a very dangerous... He didn't actually have a gun out. Well, 
Uh, this guy was in his holster. Yeah, they didn't tell me what happened in the video. The video is lost. The cars go like that. No, they got the video. They probably do have the video, but but they but they never acknowledge that they have it. They claim that it disappeared. Oh no, they. I'm I'm almost sure that 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 video was seen many no. many times. Well, I mean that might be true, and I don't doubt that, but officially it was lost. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> that I don't know. I was, I'm only a sergeant yeah. level, so there's about 300 of us. Sergeant Tommy Agency, and there's about 300 so of us. You have to be a certain level so before I, they show I, you that, that I video. I don't know. I, I don't know. If you make that allegation, yeah. sir, uh, you have a. Well, it's not an allegation. It's a fact. Well, you know what? I mean, you're saying that, but you really No, it is a fact that, that they say the video was not functioning that day. Okay, that, that, and that might be true. I don't know. I don't know. It's beyond my soul. I'm not, I'm not at that level of investigation and interaction. Yeah, but see, here's the thing. I'm not, uh, my rank is zero, and I know about it. So you're allowed to investigate stuff even if you're just a sergeant? Oh, well, of course. Okay. You're allowed to look into cases and see if they well, actually measure up? I also have an area of responsibility. My area of responsibility right now is here. And you're so in public, right? So if you, if, if, you're, uh, if you're claiming that this person was unlawfully assaulted and battered and mm -hmm. taken up the country, I'm not just claiming that. I've showed you a video of it. You did, but, but I, and as I said to you before, I don't see the whole thing. So there may be something But you else. see the part where they're assaulting him while he's going well, on let me, the ground. Let me ask, I'll, ask I'll, I'll, I'll just point this to you. And I'm not saying that this happened. Mm -hmm. Say if that person, just say if he did, mm -hmm. a minute before that, swung a knife or tried to stab that person. Mm -hmm. Just say he did. But... I'm just saying, oh, okay. oh, I but the like problem the with that is the bouncer was a fear for Now we're talking about stuff that is not even alleged. Well, well I don't know that. But, but we do know that because they've never made that claim. But I don't know that. If that happened, they would make that claim. Let's agree with the you. other okay. thing about that is okay. if he swung a knife and that knife was removed from him and he's on the ground defenseless, then you can't still keep beating on him, right. regardless of what he did a minute earlier. You know, let, let me see that again, because I saw him struck several times, and then it looked like the, the striking stopped. No, so that, that's, when that's when the choking started. Okay, I, I didn't see that. Let me see that. Let me see that. And I'm not... I'm, I'm gonna gonna say, I'm and the other part is where... Uh, first, one of the other... Um, one of the other bouncers over there obstructed the person that was trying to video tape, which he is legally allowed to do in public. And then the bouncer over here came over and destroyed his property. Oh no! Oh no! Wait, this is well, that's the other one. That was in there. That's in the Vanguard. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah. So it's all it's all closer. Well, it's not making you guys look good either. Just threw a punch. Oh well, yeah, okay. I, I, no, take it back. I'm sorry, take it back. Yeah, there we go. Okay. He's yeah. down on the ground. Yeah, see, yeah, see, that yeah. first punch, if he wasn't subdued, okay. he wasn't subdued, okay. so we can't yeah, talk yeah. about that. Look, stop! He's okay. Stop! Don't! Look, okay. no, okay. no weapon in your hand. Okay, guys, guys, guys. Okay, here's the gun. Here's the Okay, it looks like oh, oh, one, two, three, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And, and guys, to put one, okay, when you go home, you can watch the actual video where the other security guards are yelling for that guy to stop because it's so outrageous to what he's doing. It's a tough place to work, man. It's a tough place to walk by, yeah. apparently. Yeah. Okay. Well, here, I, I, it doesn't, I'm, I'm trying to see, I, I don't see him getting, I see somebody on top of him, but I don't see him getting choked. I don't see him. I'm not saying that okay. he's not. So the other punches aren't relevant. Well, no, okay, now, now he's on top and it looks like he has an arm over him. Over well, his neck choking. What about knocking the witness? I don't know if you're allowed to film time. in public places. I, oh, absolutely. And we so, wouldn't be. So that's his fault. Well, maybe you might not do it, but this video is a police officer. That's what I'm saying. I didn't have to make a mistake, there's no doubt. But the majority of us do this. And now I have to make a mistake. And my previous. Like, they should probably pay for those mistakes rather than have them swept under the rug. Because everybody makes a mistake and then and then they face consequences for those mistakes. It's true that everybody makes mistakes, but most people pay, face consequences for those mistakes. Which is an incentive for people to stop making those mistakes over and 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 over again. Actually, you're you're, you're enlightening, you know, and I appreciate talking to you and trying to keep my point of view. What I try to tell people is, or what I try to explain is, understand that when, when situations are dynamic, meaning just say for example, I'm here now, I trust you, I, I have a good street sense, so I know that nobody here wants to hurt me, I know that. 
but I may be on a Saturday night here and brought just like this, and it looks like maybe people are not too happy, so I'm, I'm staying like this. Yeah. So, uh, you know, I'm, uh, so, but you probably don't grab the guy, throw him on the ground, and start punching him in the head. No, 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 but, but, see, but you're jumping to conclusions. Don't do that. No, I'm just asking. But I'm saying, but when, it, when situations are dynamic, mm -hmm. when they're dynamic and we're in the midst of it, even with a substantial amount of training, I'm going to let you know, police officers, we're not in People think that we're supposed to be like Navy SEALs and be able to handle stuff like one, two, three. And Navy SEALs can't the So wait, so what I'm telling you guys. is, if you were, if you were ever, I, 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 I invite you, I don't know if they, if they would allow it, to go through use of force scenarios with what we have to deal with and how people are, and the reaction from a person who, who, who was told what to do and, and telling you what's happening they react in, 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 in ways that you just can't imagine. So what I'm saying is, if you're looking at a, a, a very highly trained individual, sometimes emotion and just human instinct comes in, and sometimes those are mistakes that are not necessarily intentional. So my point is that well, a lot more. I mean, by nature, mistakes aren't intentional. That doesn't mean that you're not responsible. For no, no, I'm not right, and I, I agree with you. I agree. And the thing about it is. So you're talking about basically questionable things that may or may not be correct. The problem is when something is completely questionable and more, I mean, incredibly unlikely that it's correct and it's swept under the rug, then people start questioning those things that are only slightly questionable. Well, I can tell you this, this that, based on what, what I saw, if, if, if he struck that subject the way he did without provocation, then he should be held, he should be held, he should be held regardless because it's not his right to beat on somebody. No, no, I understand. I understand that. But and again, I tell you, when you're in the midst of the mob, I'm not saying that it's right. I'm not excusing you. But there may be. So here's the thing. There's things you. So can't here, here's the thing, though. If I'm over here at this bar and a guy's giving me a hard time, and I get emotional about it, and I punch him and knock him out, and he's on the floor, and I keep beating him, I'm probably going to go to jail for that. Well, 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 Even if well, it's well, an, an emotional situation. No, but that's without provocation. It's a little bit different. No problem. Okay, so... I'm not talking about a guy saying, to like, so, he spills a drink on you. Hey, man, why you do that? And then, and then you just go up and strike him. That's, that, that's a little bit over the top. I don't know if this, if this security officer was struck before. I, so I don't know that. If the guy so, he turned and hit him, and then he turned around and hit him. But back. regardless of that, if a guy hit me once, and then I hit him 20 times while he's laying on the ground, right, I, I'm still probably going to jail for that. No longer on the table. No, I, I understand. No, I got, I got a question. Not, not to act appropriately, but I'm just saying sometimes that that's not what happens. Listen, and, not, and you got sometimes to all, here, all, all the time. Do you, you, you think that? First. So, do you think that the police give uh, bouncers a pass sometimes in instances like this? I know, never I have. Not my guy. If they're right. wrong, they're okay. wrong. Okay, you can't speak to everybody. Uh, I, I, well, uh, listen, you'll see me out here quite a bit. I will Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. I'm brand new here. Wow. And I will tell you that, no, I won't. If, if he's wrong, he's wrong. If security officer's wrong, or am I wrong? So, yeah. that's, that's the way. I, I, so, my, my mindset is this. We don't breed like this. Well, we have got like a Somewhere in the manual. You can't please it written down in the manual. You have to be honest. <laughs> well, that's the way I get to work. That's exactly the way to do it. We can't be any one of those two to be a police officer. Right. Bottom line. Right. Bottom line. Right. Bottom line. Uh, now, what was, what, I mean, I look at this about the, uh, the training. I agree with that in theory. It just doesn't actually work out in, in practice. Well, think about, think about how many thousands of encounters that we have in here. There's thousands of encounters. LVP. Plus, it's 23 years. 140. I mean, I can't even, I, I can't, if I can say the incidents that I can remember, where, where many times, many times, I truly believe I could have shot and killed somebody, and I did, mm -hmm. because I think, I, but, and you know what, I put myself okay, in that's, the that's also part of the problem, because no, no, so when you I, know that you can shoot and kill no, somebody no. and get away with it every but single not, time. It's not a question of getting away, it's some it is people though. react differently, they have a different threat assessment. Right. Different but it is a fact, it is a fact that, you, say for example, if you, you came at me, you say you came at me aggressively, I, I feel between you and me and you, my side, I can probably handle you with my hands. Maybe. Maybe. I'm, not, I'm not saying it to, to be a, a, a confrontation, but maybe I can handle it. I look at this gentleman here. 
what's going to come out, this is going to come out. Because I can't handle I think I can handle you better than I can handle him. So I'm going to use it too. But that's the appropriate response. Yeah. That would be inappropriate because he's a big guy. He's got about 15, 50, 50 pounds on If he was sitting in a car parked over there and you took out your gun and shot him while he's simply sitting in the car, well, no, okay. that would be the inappropriate response. Oh, oh, and that probably should be absolutely. something held accountable for. Absolutely. So we can talk about where we do the proper thing, right. but the problem is we're not talking about, and Metro's not talking about, or holding anyone accountable for when they do the wrong thing. You know, let me ask, I'll, I'll give you uh, one example. There was an officer, an officer Lockett, and he worked in Southeast Area Committee. He went to a call by himself late at night, about 3 or 4 in the morning. There was a domestic, uh, domestic violence or domestic issue, man and a woman inside of a car. He goes to the car. Is that the guy that thought somebody's gun was a hat? Yeah. But his hat was a gun? So my point is this, dude. Well, he ends up, what I'm saying, this person reached into the car several times and he's told not. And he ends up pulling something out that resembles possibly a firearm. It has a shiny glow to So he thinks maybe it's a firearm. He's telling him, no, don't put your hands on him. Just listen. Just listen. Don't move your hands. Keep your hands on the steering He goes like this. He goes like this several times and finally he pulls out and he gets shot. That officer was initially going to be terminated when they reviewed the case and they saw everything. And that was one of the, the highest profile cases we had here. And he ended up keeping his job, which he deserved. Well, there was actually um, like two-thirds of the, of the use of force board resigned as a result. I know that, but, but what I'm telling here's the other side. So there wasn't actually this consensus that he did the right thing after well, the Well, no, the sheriff thought he did the right thing. And, yeah, and the, the one guy that covers up for every... Well, every right the the sheriff, I, was that Sheriff Plus? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, now, wasn't there just a recent case where there was an officer that made racial comments, yeah. um, held up, a, what was it, a, a plate? Right with the picture of Obama, yeah, and oh, yeah. pointing the gun at him, and well, and even well, other cops complain. Okay. Not only did they not investigate it, it, not only did they not investigate it, he's assigned to investigate black people. Right. So he made racist comments. I know, and I insinuated that he wanted a race war. So you can maybe what see how that it, might reflect what badly on well, what the, uh, the wisdom of Metro. Uh, I, I don't know. Well, the I know there was an internal investigation, and I, I don't know what happened. Yeah. No, no, no. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, you guys going to be here for a while? I'm not yeah. sure, probably. I'll, I'll let you know this. I, I have a, but you can see how it might make your job harder when people don't trust and, and people have hostility well, let me ask you, let me ask you. Speaking because of... Ten minutes here. Do, do, you, do you feel differently at all? Did I, did not I not on out? a whole on Metro. Well, I'll tell you this. I mean, With that information, if you get that person... If you get that person to come and file a report, I'll I'll take the report for him and I'll and I'll have my guys investigate. Okay. You, you have that? a card with you? I don't have a card because I'm new down here. But you ask for Sergeant Reyes, you can call three one one. Ask for Sergeant Reyes, and they'll put the message through to me, and I'll do that myself. And I'm telling you because if that was wrong, yeah. then I, then I don't I don't think that's right, and it, and it should be held. He should be held accountable. If he needs to be arrested, he should. But I don't know the full set of circumstances. So just because you have a tape and you see you one see a guy being beaten while he's defensive on the side ground. It. But you see one side. There's other there's other angles. There's other things that happen. The no, side. I mean, come on. I understand. There's no other angle that's going to not show him laying on the ground. No, I understand, but I don't know what he did before to get there. But that's know. irrelevant. Okay, it's not irrelevant. If he's, in the law, it's not if irrelevant. It's, if he did something, no, but if he did something that, you know, justifies him being detained, that's different than him being beaten while he's detained. Okay, okay, but well, I'll tell you what, you have my name, Sergeant Reyes. Uh, you, you can do, and I'll, I'll, I'll look into it. If you want, you call and ask me, and I'll look into it. But you bring that victim to me, because I have to talk. Well, well, you guys already have him in your jail, because he got arrested for getting beat up. Do you know his name? I don't know his name right now. Well, you know what, then I'll, 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 I'll do a little digging, and I'll try to find out who he is. And I'll, and I'll okay. try to find out. Okay, we have investigators in our station as well. Okay. No. When I find out, I will contact you. Okay. So what about so when you guys get arrested on February 12th, right in front of that location? Okay, February 12th. Hey, okay. all right. When you guys get in contact? Uh, I have, 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 have,